we have AGC 9.2 GCAM which is a modded uh, custom uh, GCAM which is very very special nowadays because of it AGC toolkit. So let's get it started I will do the full review and my device is very low end device which is Redmi 7 but if you are using mid range device or high end device then this will be very very amazing you will get some amazing photos. Uh, and I will try to show in my just low end device so keep watching and this is the new user interface of Gcam 9.2 and this is the version 1 here you guys can see total user interface is changed and the black portion is now increased and the short buttons here is portrait and photo and you guys can see the switch in video mode you have to click here then you will switch and as it is now in version 1 so you guys will get here only 4k and full hd option there is no option to change fps and i will show you some samples of video footage uh, back and front both now let me switch to camera and if you want to go any option then you have to swipe bottom to up just like this or you guys can select uh, in the setting button then you guys can open more settings and you can change anything according to your choice and if you need any kind of xml files you guys can let me know in the comment section below i will provide you and previously i made video on gcam lmc i already provided one xml file you guys can input that uh, xml file in that gcam as well so here is the custom file let file but i never uh, find this uh, thing working uh, when you are going to capture any photo it doesn't work uh, let me show you that thing I already imported uh, so many LUT files okay just click on that icon and go to quick setting and go to post processing then find out LUT file so I have already uh, imported here so many LUT files and I already selected one but when you are going to capture a photo it will uh, not take any effect on the photo i don't know why as it is a low-end device maybe that's why it's not working just let me know in the comment section below if it uh, works for you okay let me capture a photo okay hdr plus enhanced so that you can get better hdr photos no changes take effect okay let me show you that i'm using here lineage OS and i already uploaded video on it so this is it there is no changes okay let me explain other things like you can enable disable auto white balance awb or aw and you guys can uh, input your own watermark like this if you want to enable watermark then click on that m button otherwise leave it okay you guys will get general and promote and which is not working for now in my device you guys can change uh, because it doesn't have any extra lenses only one lens is here another is depth sensor so that's it and you guys will get here as their plus enhance and auto night sight everything is there and portrait night sight photo everything is working i found in my device and if you are using a high end device definitely it will work 99 percent so here is the night sight So this is the photo and you guys can definitely change uh, here I have only two lenses one is depth sensor another one is main sensor if I want to switch it so both are working uh, another one is useless so I don't want to waste time by showing this so this is actually the user interface and the main focus highlighted things is here which is exposure focus shutter speed and iso everything you can change manually now this is really insane just like MIUI and other uh, stock camera you guys can do that and shutter speed is here and focusing focus you can be changed now so uh, here you can see picking active if you want to change you can do that this is focusing system you guys can change it how you want you 
maybe you cannot see properly in camera but I can see here the focusing system it's moving from here and there this is how you guys can change and also exposure is here and you guys can see light is increasing and decreasing and then, uh, here is the ISO and other things uh, wide 1.68 and manual focus other things is changing you guys can do according to your choice now and which is really really impressive so this is the cam I already showed you so if you like the user interface you can go with it and this is amazing you will get better and sharp photos now let me show you some samples uh, which will be this is the photo which I have taken and after taking photo I change here LUT files I just used one LUT files and it will change automatically this is a next level thing you guys can see here and this is the main photo and this is the LUT photo after uh, providing the effect and this is the main photo and this is the LUT photo after changing so which is really really great and the photo details next level so here you can see 4k this is 4k uh, 30 fps or 60 fps i don't know because though there is no fps option you can select anything and i'm recording this video in 4k just watch the video quality this is 4k video recording but you guys can select right now as it is in uh, version 1 in next update we will get uh, everything fine like we can change fps so uh, if you don't want to use that version then wait for the next one and this is a uh, front portrait and i think this is also great as i have only 5 megapixel in front camera so which is really really bad 5 or 8 i don't remember correctly uh, and if you have used and is detection is perfect and after LUT using LUT files i got this photo you guys can easily change using agc2 kit i will show you right now how to use properly LUT files in agc2 kit uh, these are the photos i have all taken which is really really great and for, uh, this is the front camera yeah, you guys can see this is the uh, full hd uh, 30 fps so this is the samples and another photo so which is taken without any XML files or any kind of LUT so here is the latest AGC2 kit you guys can easily use this uh, so many so many LUT files are there actually huge collections newest top chart oldest which one you prefer and we have sub items which is film food and portrait here you can see film and we have the portrait then we have others like uh, cinematic CD, nature black and white everything is available which one you like you guys can select LUT files now let me show you how you can change it suppose I'm going to select this one just click on apply and your internet connection must be on so that it can download or it can load it is already downloaded now let me select any photo which I want to change and it will take effect after some time now this is the color and you guys can also import LUT files which you have downloaded to your local uh, storage so let me change it if I change you guys can it's changing this color the first one is great I want to keep it so how you want to save it just click here and you guys can see here download button on the top right corner just click on it and it will take some time and it will be saved to your gallery no problem now it's already saved now let me show you one thing if you want to delete it you can do that as well and any further changes you can do like LUT if you want to import just click on import I already downloaded some files like here you can see just click on that LUT files and it will be imported here now you can select and another thing is here which is Let 
Let me show this again. You guys can use edit option, exposure, brightness, contrast, everything can be changed, color and effects. So this is really a next level and great great alternative things of other uh, great features like so uh, this is the video for today guys i hope you guys understand everything if i miss anything then just let me know in the comment section below so thank you for watching